his tail's out. And now it will stay outside for the whole summertime. Hello and good morning to Thursday the 11th. It is the day before the last day that I do online work, meaning it's going to be the end of a 13 day unusual period and also the end of such a tough year of school and oh my god, I'm just so glad that we've come all the way to this date and first of all, I'm just so glad that they moved it earlier to like June 17th to start with because it was initially planned to continue until June 26th according to our calendar. And then on April 3rd the decision came that they would move the end date of this school year to June 17th but then last week we got a further update that we would be continuing online lessons only until 12th which is now tomorrow. It's 11 today, tomorrow is 12, and then that's it. A long summer break of 79 days. Whew, 11 weeks, man. A 79 day summer break this year, that's gonna be great. That's gonna get me some like, comfort after all that tough time. I knew this academic year was gonna be tough and crazy for four years. This year was absolutely crazy and since the summer of 2016 I knew it was gonna be crazy on September 2nd 2019 which was the first day of the academic year 2019 and 20 and it was just as high as the space shuttle we were on the bus that afternoon right after school ended and I was just listening to Rebecca Black Friday and I was just thinking of being in Friday it was the first day of the freaking year and how they would do when we were on that bus we would just pick some students up as it normally is but at the beginning of the year there would be plenty of students that are very far away from my home and very close to school and we would have to pick them up because of that we would have like a 95% chance of being late to school every morning but then when they got off the chance dropped to 75%, but that's still high as hell because my bus driver changed, but then he was an unfocused guy. The bus driver at the beginning of the year was a bit better than the really unfocused one I had until March 13th. Whew, he was unbelievably focused. Like sometimes we would even come late because of him, because of like, he just stops and just waits for too long, like sometimes, there was that even one occasion that I just got off the bus to check if his engine has stopped working, well that might be essential actually, so why would I complain? But yeah, my bus driver is normally like a pretty unfocused guy anyway, so I was glad to get rid of him. But what happened on March 13th was not careers day, but indeed the school closure day for the SARS-2 outbreak that we'd be doing online lessons all these 13 weeks and this online lesson like even after three weeks i would just say enough it can't i mean we had fun but it turned out pointless like why couldn't it just be summer holiday from march 13th the good thing about it is we have a 79 day summer break this year because they moved the school year's ending dates earlier twice. Initially they planned June 26th, then on April 3rd we heard the update that they would move it to June 17th, and then last week we got a further update that we will be continuing online classes until June 12th, which is now tomorrow. Yeah, I'm ready to get rid of this academic year. Yeah. Ready to leave it behind. I'm honestly ready. I'm not gonna even sleep tonight. I'm just gonna disco all night long and like I'm at a prom on a bar and then tomorrow I'm gonna book a flight out of the 2009 to 20 academic year. Okay, so today's weather. On this side, it is bright and 
absolutely shiny. Like I need to put some glasses on. But on the other side, it looks to be clouding up pretty easily here. Oh my God, like what if we get a storm while we're having lunch? I don't need to. No. Oh, that one you mean, right? Uh -huh. Oh, fine, you can. You can if you want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, this is working. Remember the guy's name? Uh, which guy? Oh, okay. I don't know, we got the ball too. Oh, I didn't know him. I thought um, I was just dancing with this guy. I was just dancing with this guy. Yeah. Alright, so what we did was we had a sandwich. And then as soon as we got out of our seats, we just made some big time jokes with the staff once again. As soon as we left, we went to Starbucks, not the Starbucks inside the shopping malls or anything, but that one right, right outside, like, you know, the Metro station and that Starbucks right near there. It's interesting that the line was like two, three people because if that was yesterday, then I wouldn't see anyone in the line, but still, we just took a step back in there. And there were some like funny lines right there, again, in the L shape. Just a couple of birds being friends. Uh oh, now they decided to move next door. Well, I mean, my next door is next apartment. So anyway, what we've been doing over the last 10 minutes, we have installed a new fan in our living room upstairs. Yeah, it's working at the moment. I mean, we just done it earlier and it's working very well enough. How about the birds? Oh, one of them went. <laughs> yep, there we go. I'll show you how it works. How about this? <laughs> oh, oh, Jesus Christ. Watch, watch how I do. Oh my god, what the heck am I doing? Let's do that. Okay, again. <laughs> my head just doesn't let it move. Yeah, I want more. That was so funny, man. Okay, his table's out. And now it will stay outside for the whole summertime. Because since tomorrow's the last day of all my classes, I. Move the table, the chairs, and all the stuff. Oh, it's just those. Yep, they'll now stay there until, I think they're gonna stay there until the end of summer, pretty much. From now, I just put them there minutes ago. And that's what it is. So, keep them like that. Another day has ended. And I have planned tonight to be my sleepless night. Just because I'm way too excited to get rid of such a very crappy period of time. In fact, even from earlier than initially planned, it's even better to say, because initially planned date was June 26th. And if today was June 25th, then yeah, I would be doing what I'm actually about to do today already. If today was June 11th, I mean, today's June 11th, but if we would still have the initially planned calendar, then I would just wait another two weeks, of course, to have my sleepless evening. So I'm excited, I'm looking, I'm thinking about just being in a night land, you know, just off the regular world. Interesting, but just like yesterday, we might get an isolated storm as I just found out from a report from Weatherbug. Okay, I'm gonna summarize this academic year once again, it's just past 10 p.m. But let me summarize it again. But this time before it began and like just the beginning. So let's take it back to December, 2018. One time that my grandma was at hospital. We were talking about I should leave school at the end of the 18-19 academic year and just go traveling around the world from earlier but it turned out not to work because 
they said I should join the 19 and 20 academic year. And I, even one month later, I kept saying the same thing, but it was already too late. The payment for the 19 and 20 academic year was made. And I, I didn't even want to join it at all. I either just leave school early or skip the 19 and 20 academic year and come back in the 20 to 21 academic year. And I mean, I knew this was going to be such a tough year and how right I was. And during that time, I kept thinking in my head just one thing. During the 19 academic year, 19 and 20, sorry, 19 and 20 academic year, only come to school on the last day, celebrating, skipping the academic year, like the entire academic year, and then going to the assembly, just getting our rewards, and then next thing, just leave the school, and me celebrating like crazy, and that's what I pretty likely do tonight, and just laugh at the times I just kept arguing with my brain about joining the 19 and 20 academic year. I mean, yeah, I, I shouldn't have even done that. I mean, it turned out that I shouldn't have even attended the 19 and 20 year. I should have skipped that because what a freaking pathetic year it was, 19 and 20 year. I am also declaring that there will be, just like last year when there was a No More 2019 fest, for the videos that I used the phrase, no more 2019 because that was also a very bad year because of a different reason i will do a no more 2020 fest previously i might have said december 10th or something like that that has now been moved to november 15th i'm gonna start the no more 2020 fest on november 15th i started no more 2019 fest on december 1st because 2019 was just a bad year in my life, not entirely around the world. Anyway, so at midnight tonight, it will be June 12th. It will be the day I've been waiting for four years, not just one, but for four years. And I'm not even exaggerating. I even remember as if it was 3.1 millenniums ago when I kept saying September 2019 felt like three millenniums. Holy freaking heck, you guys. I even remember way back in the ancient times when it was the morning of September 3rd, 2019. Like I got on the bus and I was so freaking unprepared. When I came to school that day, oh my God, the concerns that came in my head, I hated it. But at least we didn't have any like major problems. There wasn't even an occasion like, you know, some student tried to bully another by like whacking his face or just pulling out a knife, like, of course, that wouldn't really happen on such a base. But for me, it was like the first week was so lame. I wasn't even 0.001% used to it, like even less than a microscope used to it. And it just continued to get like that throughout the whole month of September 2019. And somehow it continued in October, November, December. But one thing that was rather fun was after school when I went to gym. Anyway, I'll see you tomorrow's video. I talked a bit too much today. I'll see you when it is the day that I've been waiting for four years. Have a good day. And I'm, ho I'm hoping you enjoy your summer vacation if you are already on. See you guys tomorrow. See you guys at midnight tonight and we'll celebrate such a tough year coming to an end. Bye.